Monolith applications had millions of lines of code and they had three to six month release cycles. And microservices architecture evolved as a result of the challenges with monolith architectures. When it comes to microservices, you are building micro plus service, a small REST API, a small independently deployable REST API. So each of the microservices, you'll be able to deploy it independently. And you'll also be able to scale it independently. You will be able to increase the number of instances of a specific microservice without impacting all the rest of the microservices. And the biggest advantage of going for a microservices architecture is that you can make changes easily. To make a change, you only need to make a change in a specific microservice and deploy it. You don't really need to test everything else that is not changing. And you'll also be able to innovate quickly because each microservice is independent from each other. You'll be able to try new things. You'll be able to try new frameworks, new approaches when it comes to your microservices architecture. Okay.